Alrighty guys, so we got the keys. So you can see once you loop around here, um, it's really green. There's a bunch of trees and, and life back here, but there's a the little uh, water runoff. So we're gonna go ahead and get it open here. If I can get the key going. So, you know, the big gate has a key, which is pretty nice. And then you just kind of push to open it. It's like a little oasis back here, actually. It's really neat. They've done a really good job uh, with decorating and everything. So huge trees here. Here's the little entryway. Um, and you'll notice they have kind of like a, a small little courtyard here. But it's got nice touches. You know, the painting is really nice. They've got the core bells up top. And just a nice little patio area uh, to kind of hang out. So I'm going to go ahead and get it open now. So upon opening, man, these guys have done a really great job with decorating. So as soon as you walk in, uh, you know, it's got kind of an open uh, floor plan, open living area here. The ceilings kind of taper off. They get pretty tall up there. And, uh, and, and there's windows up there as well with the blinds. <clears throat> yeah, so um, it's very clean. It's very clean in here. Love the decorating. So you come in here, it's the kitchen. There's a little bit of info, I'll put that in my card there. Uh, so, you know, they can see kind of into the living area from the kitchen, uh, which is always nice, you know. A lot of people usually leave this uh, closed off, but they've opened that up, so that looks nice. Um, and then it looks like they've got the laundry here attached to the kitchen. Uh, and then you can just kind of cover this up. Pretty sweet. So, let's see, where do I start? <laughs> We'll come in here, let's check this out. So it looks like uh, we've got the furnace right here. So that's nice. I'll uh, I'll check on, on kind of the status of that, see if it's new or uh, when it's been serviced most recently. So I would guess that this is the master bedroom in here. Here's the little bathroom. Turn on the light. Little shower. No, nothing too crazy, but you know. It's just keeping it simple. And then you've got a, a little closet space in here as well. So here's the master, pretty nice. Uh, you can open up the blinds and see your little patio outside as well, which is pretty sweet. Um, and then there's another little storage here as well. So two, two closet spaces uh, in the master. And let's proceed. Forgot this is a little cloak closet, coat closet here. Here's one of the other bedrooms. It's just a nice, simple little bedroom, honestly. Um, let's open these up and just kind of see what the view looks like out there. Yeah, so that's, wow, it's actually a pretty big yard. So past the little patio, you can see, um, you know, there's a whole lot more yard back there and it's also all fenced around. So here's the other little bedroom. Pop into the closet. All these closets are probably going to be the same uh, size. But, you know, this could be just a second bedroom, guest bedroom, office, uh, whatever. And then they have another full bathroom uh, right next to it. So that's kind of what that looks like. And then over here, kind of just mirror image. Same thing. Nice bedroom uh, or office. And then I this would be the towel. Yeah, towel closet right here. So it's kind of interesting how it, you know, there's just a small wall here, but it, you know, it kind of flows all pretty well. Um, and this is kind of cool. This is actually a little brick uh, feature in the house. A uh, little dining. So let's go outside and see what it's like out there. Put that there. Okay, the, the door opens very nicely. No, no issues there. So they've got this sweet, sweet portal pergola type deal. Excuse me, I have to sneeze. Okay, I think it went away. <laughs> so, you know, there's a, a nice little area to kind of hang out back here and it, it's protected here as well from the sun. Um, and then they have these nice plants kind of just lining uh, the entire property, uh, which is pretty sweet. You know, it, for it being a townhouse, they've done a very, very, very good job um, at keeping the privacy. Uh, you know, this cool little feature here as well with the little bird feeders. You know, it's a big yard, actually. 
Uh, I would say it's probably probably the size, if not bigger, than the first house that we saw. So, you know, there's plenty of space to to plant your flowers and get your green thumb going. It's beautiful trees in here, too. They're, uh, they're very well taken care of. And then, you know, so it kind of loops all the way around. And you can peek over and, and see the little patio there. But this little entryway, I think, is really what makes this house. It's, um, I don't know, do they have a wood stove? Did I pass a wood stove in there? I have to go look again. But there's also this little door here. And I'm guessing this leads to the garage. So let's get it open. If we can. Okay, come on. There we go. Maybe. Sorry guys, forgive me. Struggling to get this door open. What is going on here? There it is. Okay, that kind of creeped me out a little bit. This radio is on. <laughs> I thought there was somebody in here. Uh, you know, so they have obviously a big truck in here, but it's a pretty large garage. Uh, could probably fit two cars in here. This is just a really wide truck, uh, but plenty of storage space in here. And then the, uh, the water. Yeah, there's the water heater in there. Looks like it was serviced in 2017. So pretty recently. Man, that freaked me out, the little radio. <laughs> I was like, wait, did I just walk into something going on here? So we're just going to go ahead and lock that up. And, uh, and yeah, so that's, I mean, that's pretty much the gist of the house, guys. You know, I know, obviously, being next to neighbors uh, can be a little bit uh, weird. But, you know, I can find out to see if there's, like, if you can really hear the neighbors. Because the connecting wall is this wall over here. This is the connecting wall uh, to the neighbor's house. So, um, you know, the walls don't seem super thin, so I'm not sure if it would actually be a problem. Um, and, you know, like I said, all the neighbors have, you know, once you drive around, you'll see that, you know, people take care of their, uh, their yards here. Everything's pretty well uh, maintained. And also this one has a little water runoff, which is kind of neat as well. You know, not a whole lot of properties have that. Uh, in Santa Fe. So guys, if you, uh, if you want to come see this in person, if you want to come feel it out, let me know. Obviously it's, uh, it's probably not going to last very long as we've seen, uh, in the past. So yeah, if you guys have any questions, let me know and, uh, be happy to set something up for you. Thank you guys.